Hey guys, it's Nate with Stowe Training Systems. Uh, today, you know, we've been talking about goal setting. Uh, we got that kind of in place. We realize it's a whole year, whole lifetime sort of thing, not just this 30 days. Um, today, I just want to help you guys out with program design because basically program design or planning things is the big difference between training and working out. Uh, anybody can work out, go in there and get tired, you're done. But actually having some sort of program, uh, that means that you're going to get in better shape on purpose. So today I'd like to share you guys just a real basic, uh, this is going to last you probably two months of pro uh, programming and then you can just mix and repeat it. Uh, but we, we do this all the time, it's guaranteed to work, okay? Uh, so first a couple of rules, this is going to be for your first exercise. You want to pick one main exercise and that exercise should be multi-joint. So multi-joint means uh, bench press, squat, deadlift, lunge. Um, anything that's got more than one joint. Non-multi-joint uh, would be bicep curl, tricep press down, or uh, leg extension. Okay, so pick a multi-joint exercise. Here we go. Um, so what we have is our sets, our reps, and then our total. Total is sets, two times reps equals 24. So first of all, what is a set? A set is how many times you perform an exercise uh, for uh, how many rounds. The reps is the total repetition. So let's say it was bench press. If I lifted it 12 times, that's 12 reps, uh, that'd be one set. If I rest and I do it again, that's two sets of 12, okay? Uh, so that's sets, that's reps, and then total is the total repetitions in my workout. So for this one, we'll use bench press as an example. Week one, I'm going to do two sets of 12 reps, 24, okay? Week two is three sets of 12 reps, 36 total reps. Now here, I can keep the weight exactly the same, and you'll see I lifted it 50% more times from 24 to 36. That is going to make my body adapt, okay? Week three is three sets of 10 reps, 30 reps. The reps went down, which means I should be able to add weight. And adding five pounds here is cool. And you can actually add five pounds for just one of the sets. It could be one set, five pounds heavier, and then go lighter. Um, but you should be fine there. Um, let's see here. After that, it's gonna be two sets of eight, 16. And so here, I dropped the sets from three to two. That cut my reps in half almost, from 30 to 16. That's going to give you a chance to rest, okay? It's hard to do more and more and more every single week because uh, basically you're either going to become the Incredible Hulk or you're going to get hurt. And my money is on getting hurt because I don't think gamma radiation actually works like that outside the Marvel Universe. Uh, so it's going to be um, a little bit of a rest week, 16 reps. Now here's the key is that it's two sets. It's two working sets. So you might go a lot heavier, heavier, and heavier because you realize, hey, it's eight reps versus 12. I can lift more weight. But once you get to like a heavy, kind of heavyish set, that counts. And then it's two sets at the heavy weight, okay? Next week, three sets of eight. So now we went from 16 reps to 24. You got more reps. You can keep the weight the same. Then it's three sets of six. Uh, the, the total reps went down, so you ought to be able to increase the weight here. Uh, same thing, we went to a rest week, two sets of six, only 12 reps, but you should be able to add more weight. And uh, the two heavier ones count. Um, so again, kind of build it up because you're going to lift a lot more weight at this rep range. So just go until you get to a heavy set of six and then do two there. Then again, three sets of six, keep the weight the same, go to 18 reps, total reps for that weight. If you can increase, go for it. Uh, then three sets of five, it's only 15 reps, you should be able to go a little bit heavier once again, and that's going to be eight weeks on the bench press. If you Then once you get there, just go back to the top and repeat two sets of 12. However, that weight should be heavier. Flip this camera. So when you repeat it, it should be heavier, and just go back through that sequence with a little bit more weight than you did again, and then after eight weeks, do it again with a little bit more weight. Um, if you're training two days a week, I would do one uh, day an upper body exercise, and the other day of the week, pick a lower body exercise and just go through that scheme. If you're going to do three days a week, I would go with, uh, depends on your weakness. For us dudes, probably two days a week on legs and one day a week on upper body. And for uh, the ladies, two days a week on upper body and one day a week on lower body. And then just go through that progression until uh, basically you can't. And when it doesn't work anymore, what you actually do is just invert it. Uh, start at the bottom three by five and go up it. Just do it exactly in the reverse order and work on gradually getting more and more reps with that weight that you're using. And that's going to work. And that could take you years uh, to get through. Uh, that could, I mean, you could repeat that forever. So nobody has any questions. I hope you guys found this useful. Uh, if you'd like a copy of this, you can leave me a comment in the uh, comment section. I'll send it to you. Uh, and anything other than that, I'll let you guys go. See you tomorrow.